Hello everybody. Um, uh, when I first started making videos, and I've just made a handful of them so far, and it's just kind of me throwing on the camera and talking. I kind of honestly had some things I really, really wanted to say, and I've just never even gotten to them yet. Um, you know, I barely even nicked the surface of the things I really wanted to say. It's kind of the timing of everything going on in the world that um, I'm kind of just talking along the lines of in the moment right here, right now, and um, never getting very deep. Uh, I, I haven't really stayed up to date these last couple of days on what's going, what's been said by like uh, Trump or you know the news or whatever. Um, I really don't pay attention much to the news at all. But I, <clears throat> I had tuned in at the beginning to a couple of the Trump and Pence talks. You know, uh, um, I heard though, and I have not watched the video uh, or anything like that on uh, Trump saying you know there's gonna be a lot of death there's gonna be a lot of death there's gonna be a lot of death or something um, i guess he mentioned it several times and uh again i'm just taking that out of context i didn't hear what he actually said uh but i, I just want to let you know that you know the people there's a lot of christians out there that are really stressing right now um people who follow christ i don't think they're stressed if you follow christ you know um, that when you walk on the path, the narrow path that he cut for us, no danger can find you there. Um, no, nothing harmful can step foot on that path. Uh, it's called like the highway of holiness or the p pathway of righteousness or people call it different things. And, and, uh, by no means do I claim to be righteous and it seems to me I found that path. So every time I've ever stepped off that path, it's been bad for me. Every time I've stayed on that path, it's been good for me. Um, I definitely haven't been perfect. I, you know, I have been a sinner. And, uh, but anyway, uh, that pathway, when you find it, just stay on it because you're safe. You're safe there. So any Christians, you need to hurry up and find that path. Um, because uh, those who truly follow Christ, they have the blood of the Lamb on their heart. So this death that's passing over the land, this Passover here, um, anyone who doesn't have the blood of the Lamb, and I'm talking the slain Lamb who has risen, on their heart, it they're the ones that are in trouble. It's not us. So, uh, you know... Uh, it's just a fear tactic, maybe, or uh, ignorance, or something where Trump failed to mention that, you know? I don't know. Um, I'm trying not to be sarcastic. I'm trying to be loving. But, like, specifically, um, what are these, There's, you know, I can just, instead of going through, like, all these religions that aren't there, um, I could just go through, like, career choices. Like, uh, let's say... You're part of the FBI. You're not protected. You're part of the CIA. You're not protected. The FDA, the USDA, the CDC, the FCC, the ICE, uh, the NSA, uh, NASA, uh, DARPA, the DOJ. Oh, the WHO. You know the WHO. <laughs> That one makes me laugh, and, and, and because it's like, yeah, do you remember the bumper stickers back in the day, like the 90s maybe it was, it was like, uh, K-N-O, Jesus, N-O, fear, uh, N-O, Jesus, K-N-O, fear, or with the World Health Organization, the WHO, it's like, who is killing us, question mark, who is killing us, period. You know, so, uh, you know, do unto others as you would have done unto you. You know, I, I, it's it's the, the moment of the furnace is here upon us, folks. Like, anyone, any of the king's soldiers throwing Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego into the furnace shall be incinerated themselves. That kind of idea. It, it's like, I'd love to be not sarcastic and just drop, ju drop like, short little bomb bullet points but you know it's just i'm crunched for time it's so obvious that the blind is leading the blind and those who deceive are the most deceived and you know 
I'm just trying to love everyone. Am I sending out this particular video as a warning to Christians? Well, if you are just truly just a Christian, maybe. If you follow Christ, you don't need the warning. This is a warning to all those people who work for the United Nations, who are a part of law enforcement, who are a prosecutor, who are a judge, who are, you know, part of the Navy or the, the Marines or, you know, I don't know. Homeland Security, you know, the list goes on and on, you know, on and on, on and on and on. Big Pharma, Big Brother, Big Tech, people who build nuclear reactors. You don't care. People who are offshore drilling for oil, you just don't care. You never took the time to love your fellow brothers and sisters on this earth. You're the ones that don't have the protection of the blood of the Lamb. You're the ones who really need to get on your knees and pray for forgiveness. You're the ones who need to repent. Yeah. I haven't even scratched the surface, folks. I love you guys. Yeah, Trump's right. Death is coming, but it's not the way he sees it, I don't think.